This is Mario with MIA Microflight, and I have been experimenting with this um, track for these uh, micro um, racers. These are 164 scale, and I started with um, I started with these uh, tracks, which are about a quarter inch in uh, width for the upper section by half uh, half inch at the base. You can see 3D printed. It's uh, quite a one-piece curve, and then I decided to uh, do it as a uh, sort of a connecting track, kind of blocky. I also experimented with uh, some uh, some other pieces that um, <clears throat> some of these pieces that have slots. For in the for interconnecting to to each other via these uh, these little rectangular pegs. Uh, let's see. I also experimented with uh, some tracks that have uh, magnets at the ends, you know, to to be joined just by uh, by the action of the magnets. But I gave up on that because I figure. If I do it this way, it's a lot better. That way, I don't I don't need to use a lot of magnets. I can just uh, attach them like you see it here. And so this is a little more in uh, scale with the uh, with these little guys. And so this is what I've been uh, playing with. I also did some lights, my own lights. These are aluminum uh, one eight uh, inch outer diameter aluminum tubing with some LEDs, 3D printed uh, lamps. I'm still I'm still printing uh, quite a bit of these uh, connectors and uh, straights, so that, so that I can start a uh, track that I finally uh, uh, I finally finished. Uh, you know, it took me a little while to do the design because I wanted to do something um, not so simple but not too complex either. These guys love to be uh, run at, at at long stretches not not so many curves because when you have too many curves it makes it difficult for uh, for control and um, you know it's, it's better when you have some long long uh, tracks uh, along with some curves and some obstacles that you can uh, add on you know for an added uh, challenge but um, yeah I am um, I am hoping to uh, build this track by the end of this uh, weekend as I'm printing uh, some additional parts. So uh, stay tuned for that video.